Good morning everyone welcome back to another self-care vlog we are focusing on self-care the whole entire day it's 7 48 a.m i have my hair appointment in a couple of minutes starts at eight i am so excited for this new style i love braids it's getting warm and i don't want to have to do it with my hair so i'm gonna go inside and get my hair done i hope you guys enjoy this video and remember to take care of yourself <music> for my hair appointment i just got really sleepy so my one hour nap turned into a three hour nap but i am well rested i'm feeling good i wanted to show you guys this is the suitcase that you guys saw me looking at and i bought from target it's a carry-on luggage i needed to replace the black one that i got from marshall's i didn't even have the black one for a long time but it ripped and it's too small for a carry-on and i'll be going on vacation very soon i am so excited for this new travel vlog but i just wanted a better suitcase so this one was on sale the original price was 90 dollars, which i don't think this is worth 90 dollars. i don't know i just don't think it's worth 90 dollars, but it was on sale for 60 so or yes yeah, 69 no i think it was 60 60 dollars so i got it i'm gonna put this aside but i'm feeling really good after this nap now i do want to read let me show you the book that i'm currently reading right now so you guys know so this is the book that i'm currently reading youtube secrets by sean Cannell and biggie travis i'm like halfway done with this book but i do want to read it since i have some time today i love reading books and it's a form of self-care now it's 80 degrees outside it's warm it's sunny so i'm gonna apply a little bit more sunscreen on my face and i'm gonna sit on my balcony and enjoy reading for 30 minutes to an hour <laughs> I just want to take a shower, feel refreshed before I cook dinner, but I want to show you some products that I've been using. So in the shower, I use Dial. This is antibacterial soap. Now, if you have odor problem, antibacterial soap will help with it. I had an armpit odor issue. I was sweating a lot, which caused my armpits to smell. So it was like sweating and the bacteria mix caused the odor. But I use this every night. I'm telling you, this really does work. I get them from Target. I get like a package of like 10 or 12 and it lasts a really long time. So this is what I use in the shower. 
and then it doesn't smell good I mean it's not that it doesn't smell good but it really doesn't have a smell so after I use the antibacterial soap once I'm all clean and get all the bacteria off my body I follow it up with body wash this one is the Dove Pampering Shea Butter and Vanilla Set and it smells so good and then afterwards for lotion I am going to use the Jergens Oil Infused Enriching Shea Butter I didn't realize I have so much shea butter products, but I didn't do it on purpose. I just, I don't know, I just have so many right now. So this is the lotion I'm gonna use. And then I also use the Cocoa Formula Butter with a vitamin E for dry skin. I like to use it on my feet, my elbows, certain dry spots that I have. Cause you know, I do use hot water. Hot water I've heard will dry out your skin, but it feels so good in the shower. Like I can't stop using hot water. So I just make sure I follow up lotion and then in the shower i am going to use the shower steamer i got it as a gift it smells really good it smells like eucalyptus which i love i love essential oils so i'm going to put it at the bottom of the shower and i think it's supposed to be used for aromatherapy it's supposed to make you feel calm and relaxed and stress-free we'll see if it does but yeah i'm gonna use it and then i'm also going to do a face mask this is the vaseline petroleum jelly ceramide mask and then i'll use my jade facial roller this was a gift as well it's supposed to reduce puffiness dark circles which i don't have i don't have any makeup on <laughs> um it's supposed to lift the face draw away toxins and toning i don't know if it's going to do that in just one go but i'm sure it's going to make me feel good so i think i'm going to put this in the fridge so it's nice and cold before I use it and I'll see you guys once I'm done taking a shower okay guys I just took a shower and I feel so good no matter what you're going through if you're feeling under the weather if you have a cold if you have allergies just taking a shower makes you feel like a new person like I feel so good and refreshed and I did like the steamer it smelled really good it lasted maybe like three minutes and that was it. I was like, ooh, it smells good. I can smell and feel the essential oils. I'm breathing it in. And then it was done. <laughs> so that was good. But let's talk about skincare. My skin is really dry because I just washed my face. But do you guys know I use La Roche-Posay Purifying Foaming Cleanser. This is for normal to oily skin. This is what I use. It's This big bottle is maybe like $21, but it lasts a long time. This is my third bottle. So then I use a toner. This is Thayer's Facial Toner Witch Hazel. The scent is coconut water and it's alcohol free. So I'm gonna take a cotton pad and wipe my face with the toner. And then at nighttime, I do have a prescription retinol, so I do use this. And it's only a pea size I'm supposed to use. I was just thinking about it. I think I'm going to use my mask after I'm done eating. I think I want this to be on my face like right before I go to sleep. So I'll save this for later. We'll, we'll get back to this. But I do just want to moisturize my face before I start cooking. So I use pea size. People always ask me, your skin is so glowy, Miriam. How do you get glowy skin? I'm like, girl. It's just the oil. <laughs> I really don't have glowy skin. I just have oily skin. So the glow that people see is just oil on my face because I just have oily skin. I mean, I had to buy oil blotter sheets. I have three of these and I put them in my car, in my bag, my work bag. When I, when I travel, I bring this because my skin is just, whew, it just looks so oily. I gotta bought it a couple times a day. This is the moisturizer I use. This is Cetaphil Dry to Normal Skin Sensitive Skin. It has avocado oil, essential vitamins, B5, and B3. Now, I did have um, the La Roche-Posay Moisturizing Lotion for like oily skin, but I mean, it was maybe this small, right? <coughs> bless me and this thick and it was $23 and it didn't last long now this 
This is, I think, $14, 14 to $15, and it lasts a really long time. So I'm like, you know what? Moisturize, I'm just gonna use Cetaphil. And then lastly, sometimes I do go in and use Vaseline as like an eye cream. So like I'll put it under my eye, around my nose, because I have allergies and I blow my nose a lot, so it kind of gets dry hair. But I'm not gonna do all that because I will be using Vaseline sheet mask and I just don't want my skin to be too oily. And it was like literally an hour from now, it's just gonna be so oily. But yeah, this is my bare skin. Well, and that's what I do. That is my nighttime skincare routine. I don't always use a sheet mask. That's like once in a while. So yeah, and now I'm just gonna moisturize and then start cooking dinner. protein and they come in a box of four i got the cookies and cream flavor but i'm gonna have that for dessert there's only 13 grams of sugar not too bad for dessert but as you can see they have like different ones here i do recommend these really good and then i'm actually going to watch physical 100 one of you guys shout out to you hold on let me shout out this person i asked you guys for tv show recommendations and matterless 8717 recommended physical 100 which i actually watched i think when it first came out last year and it was really good competition shows there's only two that i watch uh which are survivor and amazing race um but their season's over and i saw physical 100 like a year ago i was like oh this looks interesting um i forgot i think it's filmed in south korea so i had to put on the subtitles the english subtitles but it was really good and the person told me that they came up with a new season so that's what i'm gonna watch on netflix <laughs> 